Now that we are officially in the Atlantic hurricane season, it was Tropics Tuesday on Good Morning Jacksonville, and you can catch it every week on Tuesday. This week, we bid adieu, of course, to Arlene, that short-lived tropical storm that we saw uh, in the Gulf of Mexico that moved away from Florida. And as we head into the next several days, weeks, we're going to keep an eye on the Saharan dust layer. Where is it? Usually this time of year we see some of those plumes pull across the Atlantic Ocean and bring us those hazy skies in the sunshine state. Some vivid sunrises and sunsets as well. This time last year we had already had our first plume move through late May and into early June. We've had lower concentrations across the Atlantic Basin so far this year. The dust typically coincides with a quieter start to June and July, and then it starts to fade off as we see the peak of the hurricane season uh, come into play late August and into September. So it makes you wonder how busy June or July could be now that we don't have quite as much dust across the area. Also, our sea surface temperatures are very warm in some spots of the world warmer than average as we're seeing with that system that we're watching out toward Europe versus the United States, right? Uh, and so something to keep an eye on our pal Sal. Where are you? We will keep an eye on the Saharan dust. There is some out toward our main development region, just lower concentrations than what we typically see this time of year. Meteorologist Lauren Routenkrantz, First Coast News on your side.